Good Tuesday, everyone. This is meteorologist Dave Snyder at the National Weather Service with Alaska Statewide Weather. An active weather pattern in the Gulf of Alaska has created snow around the capital city. Just some light amounts so far this afternoon, uh, but you can see a little bit of fresh white in parts of southeastern Alaska today. Meanwhile, a little bit further south down the coast from Sitka all the way down toward Craig and Klawak, periods of rainfall expected to continue there as a 987 millibar low sits so just south and west of Haida Gwaii. A little bit further north, it's cool and dry weather by and large for most of the central and western interior. Look for high pressure across the western Yukon at 1,021 millibars to keep things pretty settled down and tame. Out across the central and eastern bearing, a 981 millibar low close to the Pribilovs is pushing a front across the Alaska Peninsula. Rain and some snow across Cape Newingham and into Bristol Bay. Look for periods of rain and snow to continue. Uh, through the evening and overnight hours, a better chance for snow showers once you get in across dry land. Across the eastern part of Norton Sound, expect snow showers to continue there. Generally clear tonight across the central and eastern interior, all the way toward Arctic Village and Fort Yukon. To the west, a few more clouds across the Chukchi and Beaufort Sea coasts and northward areas of fog along the coast. A look out to the west shows a new storm system moving in across the western bearing at 975 millibars. A front will cross through the western chain as we get into Wednesday afternoon, bringing a better chance of more rain for the central chain. Eastward, a better chance of clouds and rain showers, but rain will gradually increase from west to east. Unsettled across the Gulf from Kodiak Island, across the northern and eastern Gulf with rain back into southeastern Alaska. Higher terrain will have a better chance of rain mixing with snow, and places closer to the capital city, Haines and Skagway, will also see that risk a little bit higher. Most of the interior and south central will remain cool and clear. I look for a low hanging sun to cross the sky throughout Wednesday afternoon. By Thursday, Thanksgiving Day, it looks like a generally dry day for most of the mainland with a few more clouds across the northern coast. Flurries and fog for the Beaufort Sea Coast and the Chukchi Coast with low pressure in the central and western bearing at 979 millibars. A front will move through the eastern chain and with that, periods of rain and snow along the southwestern coast, a better chance of snow from Amonic and northward. We'll look for rain showers to continue in the southeast. Find your latest travel forecast online anytime at weather.gov slash Alaska. With Alaska Statewide Weather, this is meteorologist Dave Snyder.